The Night Agent is fast becoming Netflix's biggest English language series ever after only landing a couple of weeks ago. The show follows FBI agent Peter Sutherland, played by Gabriel Basso, after his new job working on night action at the White House takes a turn. Peter must unravel the mystery of who is trying to assassinate the president before time runs out. Speaking exclusively to Express Co.uk, actress Carrie Matchett, who plays President Travers in The Night Agent and also starred in 24, addressed the similarities between the two shows. The 53-year-old Canadian actress said, It's a wild ride, The Night Agent's creator, Sean Ryan and his team crafted scripts that took you from one exciting moment to the next. Politically, it is fascinating. It's a fascinating thing. I think people love 24, I love 24, and The West Wing, it's a different story, but people love American political stories. It's the perfect situation for high drama to occur and I just think it's something you couldn't put down when reading it and it's something you can't turn off when you're watching it. It's just an exciting moment and hook. Don't miss. BBC's Carol Kirkwood spats with Charlie State over cutting airtime, video Deborah James' husband and children speak out for first time, update Dickinson's real deal expert Cheryl Hakeney quits after 14 years, latest, along with the night agent, Matchett also appeared in season 6 of 24 in which she played Lisa Miller, who was secretary to the vice president and also in a secret relationship with him. Matchett appeared in 10 episodes across the season and managed to make it out alive, an impressive feat in a show known for killing off characters indiscriminately. She went on to say whether the night agent could be the new 24, I do, yeah, I really do. I think it might already be. Nobody knows if something's going to last for seasons but I think it's captivated people in the same way 24 captivated people. 24 ran for a total of 8 seasons from 2001 to 2010 with a TV movie 24, Redemption in 2008 and a shorter 9th run 24, Live Another Day with just 12 installments. There have also been attempts to continue the franchise without its lead Sutherland including the 2017 show 24, Legacy with Corey Hawkins taking center stage. Sadly, the show was cancelled after just one season with reports of a prequel later getting scrapped. Most recently, it was reported in 2022 Sutherland was open to making more 24 and suggested there was more of Jack Bauer's story to tell. Matchett isn't the only 24 star to have appeared in The Night Agent, D. B. Woodside, who plays PR man Wayne Palmer and the brother of iconic President David Palmer, Dennis Haysbert also appeared as Eric Monks in the Netflix drama. While fans will be waiting with bated breath for news on 24, Netflix confirmed it's given the night agent a second outing with Basso reprising his role for a new mission. Details on season 2 have remained sketchy with Matchett admitting she's not yet sure if she will be returning as President Michelle Travers but hope to do so. She also said the show's creator Ryan hoped to take the central character on a new mission in a new location. Don't miss. BBC's Carol Kirkwood spats with Charlie State over cutting airtime, video Deborah James' husband and children speak out for first time, update Dickinson's real deal expert Cheryl Hakeney quits after 14 years, latest, adding, it would be difficult to return to the same setting after so many characters had perished by the end of season 1. She said she'd had a good feeling about the series when she started working on it with her gut instinct about the night agent's success now speaking for itself. 
The actress is now going to be appearing in the film Haley Rose and is also going to be featuring in the upcoming fifth season of Fargo opposite British actress Juno Temple and Mad Men's John Hamm. She said the experience of working on the hit thriller was amazing and hailed the role as a great part. Matchett will be starring alongside some stellar names including Hollywood star Jennifer Jason Lee, Joe Carey of Stranger Things fame, comedian Lamorne Morris, Reach Amore Johnny from Never Have I Ever and Canadian star Dave Foley. The Night Agent is streaming on Netflix now.